Hello, today I'll be teaching you how to tie a rope necklace that has, with the shell having one hole in it. This is a spondylus from the CNMI. So first off, when you're drilling and it's one hole, and it's just a raw pendant and uh, it's not a circular bead pendant, I, I prefer to drill starting from the back and right where this edge meets the the the, the show <laughs> like right here if i can explain it somehow so i drill there and uh you have to make sure that the hole is big enough for both both ends of the rope to fit through and once you've done that you need your rope and you're going to measure I, i'd measure about three feet of nylon or whatever rope you're gonna use. Then you're gonna want to put both ends of the rope through the back of, the back of the shell. Now you see, I'm gonna pull, but I'm gonna put my finger, my fingers at the, as I pull, so here, then, uh, you're gonna want to make sure both ends of the rope can fit through this little loop at the end. Then you're gonna pull up. Then there you go. Now all you need to do is tie it. And make sure the rope is long enough to fit over your head and when you tie it, it's still long enough to fit through over your head since there's no clasp or lock on this. And you're just going to want to tie a triple knot, just one knot. Two knot. And three knot. Yeah, make sure you have enough rope when you have enough excess rope when you're tying your knots because it can get really tight. Right, like right now, I'm having problems. There you go. There's your triple knot, and basically, all you need to do, or what I recommend, you don't have to do this, is burn the ends of the rope just a little bit. Is a jet lighter because when you don't burn the ends of the rope as your necklace ages and when you burn it you can go touch it to this it's not safe but it'll make the edges flat because when you don't burn the rope the, the rope can fray and stuff then the necklace can get loose and you don't want that to happen just make sure your knots tight Okay, thank you for watching.